Welcome to the office. Let's see what we're finding today. Starting at the base of the neck. We've got a couple of flutters. I got right there about six, seven points of pressure on the left atlas. So overall, how do you find your husband since we started? He said he feel good. I see he's running on the beach and going swimming. Now, go ahead and scoot forward, please. There we go. Feet together, open and close the knees. We're checking pelvis. So the major things we're working on, remember, is your S3, your left EX pelvis, and we're going to be working on the neck. Right side only. A little bit of movement on that left side. Not so bad. Left side only now. That's fine. So we're going to continue on down here. S3, left pelvis, and C1. Left ear down. There you go. Gotcha. There we go. S3. And that's the home one. So turn your head to the left. We're going to get a little more of C1 here. Yeah, left hand here. There we go. C1. And that's a home one for you. Walk it off, please. Pull. So we're doing EX pull involved side down, lift up and down. So I'm right there on the lateral aspect of the PSIS. Bring this down. There we go. Hold your wrist there. And we're going to get, let's bend the top knee a little bit. There we go. There it is. Relax the bottom leg, sir. Look straight ahead. Gotcha. Neck is clear. More balance, more symmetry. And you are clear, sir. Now let's go ahead and adjust the ears. Gotcha. And the shoulder over, around. And the shoulder left side. That's all. Stand up for me. Let's check the hands. Squeeze. 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 One more time. A little bit on you. I don't know. Let's go with radius. Squeeze. Relax there. Continue having fun at the beach, please. Squeeze. Okay. Any more questions that have? Okay. With your sternum and nose on your back here, please. Is it me or does that feel different? I think it feels different. Yeah, it's a little bit. So you mentioned this was an older injury, correct? Yeah. At least 20 years or more. So it's calcified. We're just getting movement in there to get expansion of the ribs in and out during breath. Anterior rib, we're setting it straight A to P, thumb, thumb on thumb contact. And it's very light. That's it. Okay, now let's go ahead and do the nose. Any change in your breath? I got a, my nose full of salt water at the beach again, so that cleaned it out. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice and easy there. Gotcha. Great. Walk it off last time. You are all set for today, sir. Okay.
So why don't you tell tell us or tell me what's been going on since you got here and how you've been feeling? Um, what are some changes that you've been experiencing? And what did you actually come for? What was the first thing you came for? Why did you come all the way from northern Alberta, dude? Because I had my back, lower back was really um, spazzing on me a lot. For how long? How long was it spasming on you? A year and a half. We're starting at the base of the neck. So we've been working on your low back, your pelvis, kind of everything. You want the first good news today, sir? Sure. Your neck is clear today. I got a tiny bit right there in the upper back. I got one there right at the pimple. Pimple's our stop sign. These are little flutters, nothing major going on there. We got five, six points down low. You're holding pretty good from where we started. How are the spasms since we've been here? There isn't, there isn't any. No more spasms? No. And the big thing we found on you in order to stabilize all of this, besides working on the sacrum, is your left pelvis, remember? And this left pelvis has gone EX, it's gone out. That left pelvis is what needs to be fixed along with the leg length inequality. We started with 16 millimeters and we have to get that under seven for all this stuff to hold. So we're actually gonna be doing a re-x-ray. Three, seven, sacrum, pelvis. Over here, I'm gonna be doing a pull, pelvis pull, EX pull move, lift up, there you go, and there. And we're doing it, yeah, look straight ahead, please. Let's walk that off a couple of times, please. Okay. And we're going to do S3. S3. And this one's easy. Nice and easy. Good. A little bit more. Gotcha. One, two, three. T7. Let's walk it out. Walk on your toes for me, please, halfway. Walk on your heels, please. Come back over here, have a seat. Neck is clear. T3 is clear. T7 is clear. All clear. Scoot forward, please. Feet together. Open and close the knees. Open and close. Right side only, beautiful. Left side only, nice and muy bueno, senor. Right shoulder, over, around. Try not to help this, over, around. There you go, ears. Stand up for me, please. Don't make that ears, but I won't do it anymore. There's nothing left. Squeeze, squeeze. A little bit on the ulna today. Posterior ulna, posterior distal ulna. Got you sweating today. Squeeze. Questions? Can you check this? Yep, on your back, please. So he has an anterior front rib. Go on your back, please. Which is over 20 years old. Take your, you're okay? Take your hand out of there. So I was being mindful. I didn't share this story. This is a cool story. It's actually a cool story. Uh, when I was an intern in, uh, with the extremity, my extremity mentor, he shared a story with me that he had to do one of these ribs. And it was an anterior rib on the sternum. And he, was, he told us to be very mindful of your depth and your thrust. And what happened when he said it, it actually went under the sternum. And he was tripping because it took him a while. He was he finally figured out how to pull it back out. 
And I'm mentioning that just to, to be mindful. You're not gonna slam on an anterior rib, okay, in the front. It's just a light sit like we've been doing. Now, the fact that he's had this for several years or two decades, there's a lot of scar tissue there, okay? And with the scar tissue, we're still, we're being mindful of it. Here's the clavicle. It's right there. Okay. And we're just setting it lightly, A to P, slightly medial to lateral. That's it. That's it, sir. And now the nose. Gotcha. <laughs> Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a beautiful day.